Okay, I'm out here trying to get some video of a couple baby groundhogs I seen. And I seen them yesterday. And I got a tiny bit of video, but not much. And the one looks like it was shot. And I find that kind of amazing because I live inside a city. I'm in a very small town, but I'm still inside a city. And uh, somebody in town must have fired off a gun. It's the only thing I can figure. I want to see if I can get if that one will come out and I can get some real close up video of it. It was really shy. Uh, I really didn't venture too far from the bush. And the other one. I wasn't afraid of anything. It literally went all the way down to the street and then came back. I mean, it really didn't even care. So, I thought that was pretty interesting. But, um, maybe I'll get lucky today. And I'll show you guys what I'm seeing. What I seem to have here... That is so cool. He's just kind of walking along the bush there. He disappeared. It's funny, all I seen was the grass moving a little bit. I thought maybe it was a groundhog. No, it was a box turtle. You never know what you're going to see, do you? You never know. That's amazing. Well, the birds are definitely out this morning. 7.30 in the morning right now. They seem to be pretty happy. I do get quite a few around the bird feeder. It seems like I'm always feeling that, like, um, Every three days. I can get quite a few there. Let me see if I can get this one on the ground and move it over. There. There it is. I hate getting old. I need reading glasses now. Well, we got a little video of some groundhog and basically had to wait about two hours before they came out. And uh, it was worth it. As you've seen from the video, there's uh, the video of groundhog. So, capturing video of wildlife is probably one of the most challenging things you'll ever do. It really needs a lot of patience. You gotta be quiet, you gotta think about your backdrop, what's behind you, where you're shadowing. Um, other animals, like if you're trying to record deer, you have to pay attention to your scent, which way the direction's going. Literally not a whole lot of difference in, um, in what a hunter does, except you're hunting with a camera instead of a gun. So I hope you enjoyed this small video of uh, photographing and videotaping groundhogs. The um, box turtle was quite a surprise. <laughs> you never know what you're going to expect to see. If you like this video and you want to see more like this, hit subscribe. Let me know in the comment section. Hit thumbs up as usual what they say on YouTube. But um, I'll try and keep them coming in my spare time if you're interested in amateur um, photography and taking video. And I'll catch you guys on the next one.